This is one of the garbage collection trucks that has recently been acquired by Mbala Municipal Council to collect waste from all over the town. The trucks undertake this work on a daily basis as one of the responsibilities of municipal authorities to keep the town clean. As a result, Mbala is beginning to acquire a spotless look. Most of the waste is collected at a plant where it is recycled into compost. Compost is derived as a result of the natural biological decay of plants, animals and microorganisms. The stable soil-like material that is the outcome is what is referred to as compost. Composting is a continuous process that occurs all the time returning much needed organic matter back to the soil. This way, it helps soil to regenerate, preventing land degradation and also helping reduce methane gas emissions into the environment. But while the compost plant does exactly this, the process is more controlled and happens at a more accelerated pace. First, the garbage is tracked into a collection point where it is sorted out to separate the plastics, ceramics, medical waste, and whatever is not biodegradable from the organic waste. We have a heap of it that you saw, and uh, when uh, the, the nylon, the pollution is unfortunately, the government of Uganda has banned, put a ban on the, on, the, on, the, on the production of this pollution. So we are we, instead, we are just landfilling them. The purely organic waste is then heaped together in heaps and the roofs, referred to as windrows. After seven days, the waste is turned over and moved to another windrow, where water is added to speed up the decomposition. Uh, we water to, to aerate, you know, we, 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 when we, we, we water, we aerate because one thing we know is that water has some oxygen in it which facilitates uh, composting also. The temperature in the waste is measured constantly in order to monitor the oxygen levels. The amount of allowable oxygen should not exceed the optimum levels if the microorganisms are to reach their peak and facilitate the process of decomposition. It goes through, as it composes, it goes through very high temperatures, to a tune of 75 degrees Celsius. Very high temperatures. That's why when we tell you that the you know, germs get destroyed. During this process, the water that has been added to the waste is collected as it seeps out. All the leachate that comes out of this is taken into the leachate tank and then we recycle it, we reuse it. We recycle it, we reuse it, uh, we use it for adding more moisture um, into the compost. The compost is sieved to generate coarse and fine compost ready for use in gardens and farms. We are selling the compost at 100 shillings a kilogram, that means uh, 10,000 shillings a bag and uh, 100,000 shillings a ton. Farmers who have had the opportunity to use the compost on their farms are full of praise for its effectiveness. Has helped the, 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 the manure has helped us to, to manage our mangoes and the, plus the, 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 the oranges. The oranges are doing well, the mangoes you can see. But the introduction of this recycling and compost making technology has not completely solved the problem of solid waste in Mbale town. Many of the residents still do not dump their waste in the designated way and places. The biggest poor challenge we are still having with the, some people, the residents of town, is the irresponsible way of dumping cabbage, others shop owners sweeping after they have cleaned the streets. So what we are putting in place now, we are introducing instant fines that if you are got after they have swept the street and you are sweeping rubbish into the street, you will be fined there instantly. If well harnessed, 
Composting is a viable way of transforming various organic wastes into products that can be used safely and beneficially as biofertilizers and soil conditioners. Only if the residents are able to separate organic and inorganic waste for it to be effective.